peel. I'm keeping it very, very low key right now. I, I, I want to really stick with the energy of the, of the match and of the room. Sure. And sure. really, I think we're all we're all here to enjoy uh, players like Tezer uh, prove himself. Yeah. In, in this little more manageable arena of talent. I think he's, he's seated fourth. No, oh, this is one of the lower. Okay, so he must be five or something. Uh, yep, five. We got J Lo right above him. So, um, yeah, for those of you who don't know, Tesner, a uh, 13 year old kid, came here notoriously took a game off Captain Smuckers. Was it? I thought it was just close with Captain Smuckers. No, he took a game. Oh, wow. He took a game in tournament. That's great. Um, I mean, that's the story. May not be true, but. <laughs> it doesn't matter if it's true or not. It's what? the story, right? Who cares if anything's true nowadays? You got a point. You so certainly got a point. He there. beat Captain Smuckers. Uh, he's Three number one on the PR. Yep. yep. So Tesner. Tesner for uh, Tri-State PR. Um, so I like how uh, Tesner does a really good job. I was just making sure he did it before I said anything. Yeah, yeah. When he has someone on like, when he corners someone, he does a really good job of maintaining them in that corner until he gets like the fair or the down smash or something. Yeah. Like that. And, and while moving still. Yeah, oh yeah, that's the important yeah, yeah, yeah. part, is that yeah. he keeps it ambiguous of, of where, where what's going to happen. Yeah. He usually but, uh, comes down with like there. a shield hop, or shield drop fair or something like that. Okay, here for solid edge guard. Yeah, he did the same thing. He did yeah. a good job of uh, maintaining that pressure that we were talking about. Um, also, Tesner is a big proponent of shield dropping. Um, oh, yeah. You know, new age Sheik, you know, young guy playing Sheik. I almost, mean, look at those. Almost you know? too stereotypical yeah. this guy. Ooh. Ooh. That was very smooth. My Lanter. Yeah, that was a, that was a keep moment. That was a good one. The edge guard was a good replay. Oh yeah, so we're gonna have some uh, some new production this tournament. Keep an eye out because uh, Barry's here innovating every day. So <laughs> he is Barry's in the trenches. Oh, the production real. value trenches. Let's see if Russell uh, Hirofan can close this one out. Interesting down throw there. I don't hate it, but I, I think it, it needs to be a little more. Uh, I think you really got to know your follow-ups if you're gonna if you're gonna do it, right? Because right. it's a it's tricky. Yeah, it kind of looked like he down through and then did nothing. Yeah, right? you got to shine or up tilt. Yeah, too. yeah, you got to at least go for it. If you're gonna try to read the second place, you have to you have to read the second place. You can't a lot. There. A lot of these little tiny moments where it worked out there, but Tesser got a power shield. He also got like a clank on a move, and he was a little slow out of that action. Those little skirmishes. Uh, Hero you know, Fit also didn't quite take advantage, but those are important to keep track of. Uh, do you know how like proficient Tesner is in the chain grab? Uh, no, I don't know either. I mean, we'll see. Time, time will tell. I think he I got about three forty. Yeah, he got forty off the first one. About That's, three regrabs and yeah. a dash attack. It's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I mean, harder for too much more. Yeah, yeah two stock. Is Falco harder than? Then Fox? Yeah, he, his uh, tech rage is longer. Oh, wow. So you have less, uh, less time. Cool. Testing yep. a little bit of a smile on his face. <laughs> Keep Not that smile cool, forever, but... please. Yeah, I know. Don't let the smile Don't fade. Don't let the world get you down. <laughs> right? Don't be like Plump and uh, smile for years and then just never smile again. Have you ever seen Plump smile in the past like a year? No, I, I don't believe he has. Is that sad? <laughs> it's really sad. That's actually really sad. <laughs> well, I mean, I've, I've, it might not be much to smile at about, you know? Yeah, maybe he knows something about knows being something a pro melee yeah. player. Yeah. That's how he got good. I think there's a direct correlation, you know? Of not smiling anymore? Yep. yep. Honestly, Does West Ball smile? Yeah, a little bit. Sometimes. When yeah, goofy true. things happen. But he doesn't really smile, right? Uh, Pew Pew doesn't smile. What are you talking about? Not when he's serious. Oh, I see what you mean. So these people smile all the time until it's time to buckle until down. Until it's time to buckle down. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. You can't have fun. That's how Vortex gets you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You have fun and he's involved. He's like immune to it. Yeah, he's immune to the fun. Dude, you're so right. I'm so right, dude. Oh you, my just can't, God. you just can't have fun. Until after. Because I think about matches where I'm like laughing and stuff. And you play terrible. Yeah, and I, but I come out like, accepting the loss is good for your mental health, I guess, but it's bad for your bracket. Yeah, you're not going to play well. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. No, it's really, I'm serious. Are you, are you kidding? No, I'm, you? Not, I'm not even being like sarcastic. Like, I, it's kind of a revelation that yeah. it's not always worth it to, to be happy. It's not. Wow. Well, you That's should be serious, too. you know? <laughs> laughing some things off could be a good strategy. You just right, have to right. buckle back down. 
It's when you're like, oh man, he's messing me up. That's when you lose, you know? Yeah. Well, let's so, see. Oh, if I got another grab here. If I'm here, I'm not smiling. Yeah, no. No way. Not at all. Ooh, good pressure. There you are. Not getting caught by that Randy forward smash. And, oh, but Tezzer's at. Oh. Tezzer's cooking, dude. Oh, yeah, oh real. man, look at that Nair. That was so smart. I would have tried to go for a fair and it would have never worked, right? The Nair was just... <laughs> Tezzer actually opts for Nair a lot. Nair? Mm. It's a good move. Low. It's a little, uh, a little safer. Um, it covers a lot, you know. It's the highest uh, damaging move for aerials. Did you know yes, that? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's why at low percent, uh, Always, when yeah. she gets a grab on Peach or Puff, she should opt for Nair. Yep. yep. That's the only reason I knew that. <laughs> yeah, Nair's uh, because of my fantastic. Character. Sheik's Nair is like ridiculous. Oh, it's a great move. A little underused, in my opinion. I'm surprised Tester didn't go for a down air there. He loves doing down airs. Yeah, he loves doing down airs. That's his favorite. He likes just the not, the not utilized aerials, yeah. I guess. The dare, dare. So, uh, congratulations. One more thing. Oh, what? these. Oh. Yeah, congrats to Tesner. Nice little two zero. Yeah, Ooh, I mean that's see. exciting. Oh, okay. It's the end of match. Nice. Yeah. Did you get the edge guard?